Fernando Cuadrado es inertia Uruguay. How the manual water pump precipitates alternative water pump and mechanism animation works. We will show two different pumps with the same operating principles. Let's know your parts. Lever. Connecting rod. Cylinder. Piston or plunger. Mechanical seal. Retention and output valve. Retention and input valve. Suction tube. Water pump operation. Water pump 1 Through a lever a piston is moved to which it goes. Lowering the piston increases the pressure of the air and air inside exhausting the valve. Up the piston decreases the pressure of the chamber and the water rises pushed by the exterior atmospheric pressure. When the piston is down again, the water is retained by the valve of the aspiration code and passes up to the top of the pump through the piston retention valve. We see more near. When suctioning, the valve is lifted allowing the passage of the underground water. And by lowering push it close the piston valve and open the output valve allowing the water outlet. A lift pump is a type of reprecating pump that draws fluid in at one end, expels it at the other end. The pump consists of a piston moving to and fro inside a cylinder. Two valves regulate the flow of water into and out of the cylinder. As the handle is pushed down, the piston is raised, reducing air pressure in the cylinder. Reduced air pressure. The outside air now has a greater pressure than the air inside and pushes the water up the pipe. As the handle is pulled up, the outlet valve opens. The inlet valve closes, preventing water from falling back down the pipe. As the handle is pulled down, again the piston is raised, lifting water to the spout. The outlet valve opens as water is forced up above the piston.
water resting on top of the piston pass out of the spout. At the same time, more water is drawn up through the inlet valve. Water is pushed up into the pump by the pressure and the atmosphere on the water in the well. This limits the distance that water can be raised using a lift pump to about 8 meters.